Be prepared to observe the creation of PDFs automatically for addresses that are not WinLink addresses. The PDF creator is a new feature added to WinLink Express in November 2019. So what's that all about? Let's do a quick demonstration of how the PDF creator works for non-WinLink addresses. So let's create a message, new message. We're going to create a 213. And there is a general 213 incident name. So we're going to send this to participants. Uh, we'll send this to uh, from myself. And the subject will be uh, hello world. And we're going to send uh, this is a test message. Copy it. And we'll paste it a few times. Create some volume. And approved by me. Position title radio operator. We're going to click submit to send. That's vanished into. There it is. So here is the. email it is been it has the usual xml attachment so we're going to send it to uh, a ham friend and we're going to send it to our gmail account which might be a served agency or anybody else and we'll click post to outbox. The software is now recognizing that there is a non winlink address. The Gmail account is going to get its own separate message. So you can see the two outgoing messages in the in basket, the correction in the out basket. We've got the standard small size one, just 1,300 uh, uh, bytes for the regular WinLink uh, address. But the non-WinLink address, the Gmail account, is going to get a PDF. If we open up the PDF to look at it, it will open in our PDF reader as a regular PDF, which your served agency will read. And if you're CCing them on traffic, they would probably appreciate the uh, separate email much more in the PDF form, because they're gonna get all the formatting of the ICS form without using the, uh, the WinLink software. So will close this up. And I need to show you one more thing. But back under, let's uh, save this in drafts without sending it. Let's go into settings. Where do you set this up? And how do you make it work or not work? So under settings, and we're gonna look for form settings. And there's a checkbox down here, which says send forms as PDF files to internet addresses. And it comes with a caution there, that if you enable this option, Messages with form attachments are going to be huge as a PDF file. And you're going to need a really fast connection, either uh, Pactor or Vara or Telnet, in order to get that message uh, out into the Internet. Uh, otherwise, if you have a slower connection, it's going to take 30 minutes to send that, and you'll make a lot of enemies uh, during the exercise by tying up frequencies. So if you click that box, send forms to PDF files, internet addresses, uh, use that with caution, please.